I had a question from a user on how to create a binaural beat session synced with audio strobe using my gnarl template. So I'm just going to quickly show you how to do that. So let's open my template here. You'll want to download that. I'll put a link in the description. So you open the audio strobe gnarl template and that brings in an isochronic pulse track and how audio strobe is is it is a sine wave tone that is at 19.5 kilohertz or 19,500 hertz and that's what makes an audio strobe track there is a particular volume that's required 0 0.125 is a nice maximum uh, light signal to get the full range of audio strobe so leave that alone leave the bass frequency alone alright so I'm going to show you how to take this and create some nodes and then make a binaural beat so here we have this track I'm now in the beat frequency so I'm just going to go along and click a few nodes it doesn't really matter this is just for an example what they are so there's about 5 hertz there's about 3 or, or I'm sorry that's about 8 and then point 0.7 and that's about 7.7 .7. you know you get the idea you can read the frequencies along the side there now what you want to do is you want to duplicate this voice alright so you go under tools duplicate selected voice that makes a second one turn off the first one now this second voice is a duplicate of that so what we want to do is we want to select it right click on it choose binaural beat and then you can get rid of the description and you can just say binaural beat to sync alright that's fine okay so there is our binaural beat now we want to change the bass frequency because it's still in audio strobe range it's too high so we'll go under select all alright then we can just move it down just grab one of the handles drag it down so let's see that's it just over 600 Hertz let's get to around 100 alright right there so that drags the track in makes it able to be within a hearable range we've converted it to a binaural beat it still has the same frequency layout as was set for the isochronic pulse track you can play that and it will be audio strobe alright audio strobe sync to binaural beats and that's all you do and it's just that simple so thanks for watching Scott Henderson have a great day